All right, when it comes to things that uh, freak people out in their homes, I think mice probably top the list. Yeah, I would think, and that is a prime time right now for the little critters to try and make their way into your home. And if you see one, well, it's probably not alone. You never have one. They have about six to eight babies every couple of months or so and it, it can it can multiply pretty darn quickly. Russ Rzyski of Complete Pest Control Services smiles when customers tell him they keep seeing a mouse. It's almost never the same mouse. <laughs> Rzyski says we unwittingly create the perfect environment for them. If you're packing your basement with a lot of boxes and storage up against the walls and you don't get through there very often, mice love those types of areas and will nest throughout that. And if you're working in the yard and leave the garage door open, mice will find that in the blink of an eye, especially if they're in the area. So how about those mouse repellents? A lot have oils, um, peppermint oil. I don't use it very often with my clients. You have to, to replace it and keep it fresh. And he adds. For it to annoy the mice, it has to annoy us. I mean, it has to be strong enough that, that, that we sense it too. He also says bird feeders are a mouse magnet. The birds will kick a lot of food onto the ground and the mice eat that up. Yeah, so put that bird feeder as far away from the house as you Ugh. can. And if you're going to put traps out, Russ says, look for areas where the mice will come in, like around the garage door. Yeah. Anywhere that's as large as a dime is where they can, they can get, get in. in. I think that's the toughest thing about some of our older homes in this area is right. that there are, there are holes, you know, it's just their old homes. So how do you plug up all of those little tiny dime sized holes? Oh, you could just live with the mice. Yeah, all, you, two days now you've left me speechless. I have nothing to say. Oh, and if you catch one in a trap, reset the trap because you're probably going to catch more.